Hi guys, welcome to today's first look, first reaction at the new House of CB range. I believe it's called Golden Hour. This is my first time looking at it. I've seen like a few little bits, who you knows? I've seen a few little bits on their Instagram um, page, like stories. They did like one of their fashion videos, which should be playing at the side of me right now. Um, so yeah, let's take a look at their new pieces. Right, okay, so the first item up is this Tate Black Vintage Fit Antique Wash Jeans. Okay, I thought it was gonna be the top, but it's the jeans. And you know what, I actually, I, I like them, yeah. I like the jeans, I'm a fan. I know that they've just recently started doing denim in the past few months. So I haven't tried any of their denim things yet. I'd be interested to see if it's House of CB, I think we can be quite confident that it will be decent. Um, I don't like where this mic is. Um, I think we can be quite confident in House of CB that their denim range is gonna be quite good. So if any of you watching this have got anything from their denim line, I say denim line, they don't have a denim line, anything that they have recently created that's denim, let me know, hit me up. I like these, they're high-waisted, I like slashes and jeans. Um, yeah, they look good. I'm not keen on this top though, I don't think they've released this top yet. I don't, I, I'm, I don't like that top. Oh, I've just been punished for saying that. I've got like a ringing sound in my ear. <laughs> I'm having all the ear issues, guys. Um, I've recently cut out coffee because it, I think it's making me have vestibular migraines, which are dizzy migraines, and um, it's not a good time, but I'm not doing very well without the coffee because my ability to focus is result, result, reduced to zilch. Do you see what I mean? I can't even speak. Next up is this top. I like this a lot. When I first seen their little promo video, I seen some of the floral things and I was like, I don't think I'm going to be feeling this new look, which will be sad. I don't think they've ever released a range that I haven't liked, but there's always a first time, and just because you don't like one range doesn't mean you don't like the entire brand. But um, I was a little bit skeptical, because I was like, I'm not sure how I feel about the dark floral. But the more I think about it, the more I'm like, it's a really 90s vibe, and I can, I can get down with that. So this is the Genie Top, which is a black floral corset. And I think this is gorgeous. I actually really like it as well that they've paired it with the light denim jeans. I don't know, the dark denim jeans. Jeans. <laughs> um, I like this top a lot, I think it's sexy. So yeah, this gets a, this gets a oh yeah from me. I don't know what oh yeah is. It's apparently a new thing I've created just now. So the next thing on their recently released is this beautiful Reva black satin balcony corset dress and this gets a hell yes from me. Look at it, look at it. I mean, on the plus size model, the way like it drapes across the front. Oh my gosh, sexy as. In fact, does it do that on the, I can't really see on here. Let's look for other pictures. I don't think, it doesn't do that on the, it doesn't do that on the, what would the opposite to plus size be? It doesn't, done that, it, just, it doesn't do that on the smaller sizes. Actually, I say smaller sizes, I'm not gonna get into the House of CB sizing range. I know a lot of people want a plus size range and I mean, I, I'm all for that. So, uh, but I'm not gonna get into it because I think it's very easy for me to comment on something that doesn't affect me. So I'm not gonna, just gonna leave that there, put that one to bed. I am absolutely loving it. What do you call this model? I follow her on Instagram and I can't remember her name, but look at the, how amazing does she look in this dress? This dress is beautiful. And it's 119 pounds. And the description is this work of art. And it is, it's beautiful, beautiful. Um, it is cut from their signature heavyweight and lustru lustrous stretch satin. Um, it's a fully bone bodice. Yeah, this is, this is, this is something that I need. I would pair this with some So Kate, red lipstick, hair tied back, like these buttes here. Yeah, these girls look amazing in this. Everybody will look amazing in this. We all need it. So do you know I was saying a moment ago how I was unsure about um, the print, the darker print? They all look amazing in this. They actually all look really good. It's funny because in first initial viewing, I was like, I'm not too sure. But looking at this now, this is really sexy. 
I can get behind this. I actually take back everything I said about not being too sure about the dark floral print. This is sexy as, this is the Karina dress. This is £129. This is wine floral bustier midi dress. It's ultra feminine, perfect for transitional fall dressing. And it really is. I love transitional pieces. We're doing a video on that soon. Tran transitional, seasonal colors. I suppose pieces will be a thing, but it's more of a color range. In fact, I'm obsessed with this. I need this. <laughs> what is wrong with me? I'm so annoyed with myself. I'm like, yeah, I don't really. Um, I, I do that with a lot of things. A lot of things I'm like, oh, I don't really like that. That's crap. And after I look at it for more than three seconds, I'm like, oh my gosh, I love it. But the more I'm looking at it, the more I'm like, this is really, really sexy bad. It's amazing for um, summer to autumn transitional piece, it, uh, piece. And that's what they've described this as as well. Saying it's ultra feminine and perfect for transitional fall dressing. And it really is. And I'll do a video on this in a few weeks time, at some point in the next few weeks. And um, I'm loving these colors together. This makes me really happy. This is 129 pounds. Yeah, that's a really sexy dress. Initially when I seen this print, I was like, really? really house of cb and they was like yes really janine and i was like okay house of cb you clearly know what you're doing next is the millicent top this is a blue printed cropped corset top i absolutely love blue printed designs that are quite i think because it reminds me of teacup sets which I don't want that to be a diss to this top because I actually do really like this but the print just reminds me of being a child and again th this year House of CB for me have just brought out this really nostalgic vibe that I'm pretty much that I'm digging my back's really hurting guys so like this I'm gonna sit up properly so this is a blueprint cropped corset top I think it the legs are gorgeous I love the puff sleeves. I love the, um, how would you describe this? Let's see if the, they describe it. So guys, this drawstring, you can like pull it together or kind of leave it open if you're feeling like a little bit sexy. I think it would look really nice with some white linen trousers or some white, really wide legged flared trousers. Maybe a bit dramatic, I don't know. I mean, this is really cute, kind of like girl next door. This kind of reminds me of a Levi's ad these jeans and this top, like a 90s Levi's ad. Let me know what you think of this top in the comments section. Right, we're moving on to something a little bit more typically House of CB design, which is the Lakeisha dress. This is 129 pounds. It's giving us that puff sleeve drama. It's in white, which is always like a favorite of mine. I actually really like this bit here. Um, yeah, there's nothing, there's everything nice to say about this dress and nothing bad to say about it at all. I'm not 100% sure on the drama of the puff sleeve though. There's something that's a little bit off to, off, off about it to me, but um, I love the skirt, asp I love the skirt part of this. This, I think it's beautiful. I like the way that it gathers in the back with the zip down the butt as well. It just adds to that curve. House of CB really know how to get your like curves to pop which is one of the things that I absolutely love about their designs. Now I love this and it's definitely like later autumn winter transitional period, period for me. This wine velvet corset is sexy ass. And what I like about this is, is as you can see here, we've got one girl laid down with the guitar and she's got jeans on with it, looking really casual, sexy. She looks very like celebrity, doesn't she? Then you've got these leather trousers. Now I don't necessarily like these particular leather trousers with this. I think they need to be, um, for my personal taste, they need to be a little bit more legging kind of style, like tighter at the bottom. But this looks really good. You can also wear this with a skirt with other black, more formal fitted trousers. And who doesn't love velvet? This is a perfect look. This will look perfect with a really nice black midi skirt for like, Christmas work drinks and things like that. So yeah, they've it's, they've given us it for autumn, but this type of red always gives me late autumn winter vibes. Now this for me, personally, I think fits more with their Le Jardin collection, which came out spring summer time. I think this Tallulah blue white floral midi dress is definitely more of a summer look. And I reckon their top is as well. What was the top we seen a moment ago? The Millicent top. 
I think it's just because I associate blue and baby blues with spring. It's one of my favorite springtime colors. Um, so for me, I think it sh I would have placed it with that season, but they obviously haven't. They know what they're doing. This is what they've decided to do. I think this is really pretty. It looks really nice with the clear shoes here as well. I like the square cut off of the neckline and the way it mimics the same at the back as well. I like the fact that it's clinched in at the waist then comes out with an A-line shape towards the bottom. This is a really pretty dress. Yeah, so you can see these two pieces here. I think these would have looked better as a spring look. Let me know. It's funny because the dress by itself doesn't look that like, wow. As soon as you put it on someone, it looks great. Oh, so this comes in yellow as well. Oh, okay, so this basically is, so you can click on this in yellow and this is the Tallulah Lemon Floral Puff Sleeve Midi Dress, which again is beautiful. And this was part of their um, Le Jardin collection. Um, so maybe it was meant to be in there because they just had so many pieces in that range, drop after drop, that maybe they was like, we're gonna push this back to um, our golden hour. Yeah, I like this a lot. So that, those are my thoughts, which were longer than I thought they would be. Um, on the looks they've dropped so far, they do a drop every Monday. So I'm excited to see those pieces. Um, the Reva dress, do you know what? The Karina dress I'm probably gonna style this week. The Reva dress is really easy to do. So I'm probably gonna do that as well, just because it's easy. And who doesn't like low hanging fruit? Um, so I'm gonna do that. And then I'm gonna do the Karina dress because these are really speaking to me. I actually didn't really do that too many. I didn't do too many stylings at all. I think I did one styling from their previous range. I did two stylings from their previous range. I did three. I did three. So their last drop was the Paradise Nights. I've got one more look coming from that actually. I've just reminded myself, potentially two, but I do think it's one and um, two looks coming from their new range. I'm excited to see what they drop next Monday, especially having had a look at their um, this, just to see what else they're gonna be releasing. Right guys, thank you very much for watching today's video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Let me know your thoughts in the comments section and um, do check out some of my other videos, which I'm gonna put on this side. This time I'm gonna lean to this side. So I make other styling videos where I actually do style boards that look a little bit like this, so go check them out. So to check out one of my other videos that I think you'll like of the Jardin collection, check this out. Check out my other styling videos and then subscribe to my channel. I'll see you in the next video, guys. Bye.